ladies, it's Deanna from MillerFitGirls.com and today we are going to be doing arms and abs with the resistance band. So on the blog, my resistance band and ab workout is one of the most popular posts to date and it's been on the blog for over a year. So I wanted to recreate a new workout using the resistance bands for your arms and your abs. So to get started, we are going to stand on top of that resistance band. I'm using a light resistance band, so try and pick something a little bit lighter for this workout. So both feet are gonna be on it, so under the arches of your feet. Bring your left arm up, sort of in a goal post position, and you're gonna press up overhead and twist over to this, uh, and reach over to the side, and then back down. So press it up and down. So you're squeezing that oblique, and you're controlling as you come back to center. Good. So overhead press and working those obliques. Good. Press and press. Good. Nice job, ladies. You will really feel it on the opposite side in those obliques. Good. Press. Press, we're gonna do 10 to 15 reps here. Good, make sure you get your printable version of this workout, let's do three. There will be a link down below for the printable two. And last one, we're gonna switch sides. So bring that right arm up, goal post, and press it over and down, good. Press, good. Squeeze that left side oblique, you got it ladies, press. Nice job, we're halfway there. You're gonna love this workout. You're gonna make, it's gonna make those arms super sculpted, super sexy, and really tighten up, up those abdominal muscles. Press. Good, here's four. Three. Ooh, those shoulders are starting to burn. Last one. Good. Now, let's cross that resistance band in front. So you're making an X position. You're gonna rotate as you do an upright row. So you're gonna row that left arm up and rotate to the left and back down. Let's hold it on this side. Pull and rotate, good. Pull and rotate. So you're working the shoulder here as well as rotating through those obliques. Keep your hips pointed forward and you're just rotating through that spine. A good cue is to just watch that elbow as it goes behind you. Good, again, 10 to 15 reps here. Good, nice job ladies. So I want you to do this workout three to four times through. Good, let up. Let's do four more, you got it. Three, and two, last one. Good, other side. So same thing, you're gonna rotate over to the left, and pull it up. Good, sorry, you're rotating to the right from this one. Just make sure you're twisting sides, rotating. Good. Pull up. Try to relax the shoulder away from the ear. Make sure it doesn't tighten up too much. Because you won't be working the shoulder, you'll be working those trap muscles. You really don't want to work those muscles too much. You don't want a giant thick neck. Good. You can do it, ladies. Just keep working, keep pushing through. Remember, hit stay forward and watching that elbow as it goes behind. Two more. And last one. Nice job, ladies. Roll out those shoulders a little bit. And we're gonna come down into a plank position, holding onto that resistance band. So I want you to loop up that resistance band and then come into a plank position. So from here, grab a hold of that right tube. And what you're gonna do is you're going to go into a side plank and pull that resistance band up and then back down. So you're working the back of the shoulders, and then back down. You're also working those abdominal muscles, those obliques. Good. And again, 10 to 15 here, you're pulling across. Lift. Good. You will feel it a lot on that supporting shoulder. Pull it up. Good. This will get your heart rate up and really burn those calories, ladies. Good. Let's do four more. Good, three, two, nice and controlled, last one. Good, drop those knees 
down, shake out those wrists a little bit, and we're just gonna turn over to the other side. And let's do it on the other side. So again, you're going to grab a hold of that handle, and let's get to it. Lift it up and down, good. Nice and controlled. Hold. You got it, ladies. You are going to love those arms and abs after this workout. Everything is gonna be sleek and sexy. Good. Pull. We're just about halfway. Three more. Good, abs tight. Pull that belly button in towards your spine. Last one. And bring it down. Whew, shake out those wrists a little bit. Nice job, ladies. Now, what we're going to do is have a seat, and you are going to wrap the resistance band around your feet. So you wanna make it go around for one full loop around the arches of your feet. Good. So now what you're gonna be doing, I'm gonna scoot myself forward here. You're gonna hold on to those handles, Sorry, you're gonna hold, you're gonna grip up, and you're going to hold onto the actual two part. So you're gonna roll yourself partially down, hold it here, and you're gonna do a wide row. So you're gonna pull those arms back and straighten. Pull and straighten. So what you're doing here is really pulling, but pulling that belly button in towards your spine. Good, so you don't have to go super far down into that roll down. It could be up here. If whatever you're feeling in those abs, it's totally, totally fine. If you want a little extra challenge, you could go even farther down. Keep rowing. Again, 10 to 15. Let's do two more. Good, last one. Nice job. Roll it all the way up. Now you're going to grab a hold of those handles. Keep that loop around the feet, and you're gonna roll yourself all the way down. So what you're gonna do here is you're gonna roll yourself up one vertebrae at a time, pull those arms overhead, and then roll it back down. Good, lift it up, pull overhead, and roll it back down. Try and really glue those heels to the floor. We're just gonna do 10 of these, good. Pull that belly button in nice and deep towards that spine. Roll it back down. Get your spine as nice and tall as you can at the top. And again, try and relax the shoulders away from the ears as much as possible. Think of drawing your shoulder blades down your back. Two more. Good. Last one, ladies. You got it. And roll it down. Roll yourself all the way back up. Undo that loop around those feet. Roll out your shoulders just a little bit. And we're gonna put the handles around the arches of your feet. Let's get them nice and low so that they don't snap off. Let's try and keep it safe here, ladies. So nice and low, really get those heels down. And what I want you to do here is really pull onto that resistance band. So you're gonna choke up on it. Both hands are holding on nice and tight. You're gonna come into a little V-sit here, and you're gonna extend your right leg out and switch. So your chest is nice and lifted, switch, switch, switch. So we're gonna do about 20 of these, 10 on each leg. Pull your belly button in towards your spine, keeping everything nice and tight. You will be working those arms, especially those biceps, to keep pulling it in. Keep your elbows nice and wide. Good, nice job, ladies. Let's do five, four, three, two, one, and bring it down. Good, so now let's roll all the way onto our backs. You're still choking up on that resistance band, and you're going to bring those legs up towards the ceiling. Lift your head and your chest up, so you're doing a little ab curl here. You're pulling your belly button in nice and tight. You're gonna drop your right leg down and scissor, scissor, scissor. So you're pulling your belly button in tight. 
And again, we're doing 20 here. So again, 10 on each side. Still holding those biceps, still keeping those elbows wide. If you need to, you can bring one hand behind your head and switch arms halfway through. Good. And again, let's do five, four, three, two, and one. Bring those knees in. Hug those knees in towards the chest. Take that resistance band off of those feet and roll yourself up, roll out those shoulders. Remember, you wanna do this workout two to three more times for a total of three to four sets of this exercise. If you want more workouts, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Also subscribe for more workouts every single week. Also, you'll get recipes, nutrition tips, tons of stuff, and please check out thelivefitgirls.com for lots more motivation, recipes, and workouts. Bye, guys. Trying to figure out how to make my dreams become reality. That's what I chase.